Nagaland Chief Minister Nipu Rio, while campaigning for NPF candidate for Outer Manipur constituency, said that senior citizens, people with disabilities, and LGBTQIA plus need sympathy and protection. After wide consultation, Congress will bring a law to recognize civil unions between couples belonging to the LGBTQIA plus. However, this is not a tradition. It is not Christian habits, so this needs to be widely discussed. Congress manifesto. I was avoiding to speak, but this has become a big issue again. I don't know whether in Manipur you are talking about Congress manifesto. In this Nayapatra Lok Sabha election 2024, Indian National Congress, I will distribute paper. It says in the headline, senior citizens, person with disabilities, and LGBTQIA+. It says, it is camouflaged together like all people, senior citizens, disabilities, who needs sympathy and protection? But many of you will know about this abbreviation LGBTQIA. It is read, it is in this page. Number 11, after wide consultation, Congress will bring a law to recognize civil union between couples belonging to the LGBTQIA. What is that abbreviation? The abbreviation is L stand for lesbian, G for gay, B for bisexual, T for transgender, Q for queer, I for intersex, A for asexual, and others. So, they want to recognize these people after wide consultation. Congress will bring a law to recognize civil union between couples belonging to this group. It is not our tradition. It is not a Christian's habits. It is not Christian's values. And so this need to be widely discussed. Western countries, they may have such problem. But Congress trying to bring to our society. I think it is unbecoming. And this should be discussed thoroughly. You consult the Christians or church leaders. Whether it is right, it is wrong. Whether it is against Christian values or when law recognizes these groups it will affect your children, your future children, and there will be no system. Therefore, many unknown and which are not 
possible in our society. You can't even imagine. I think we should thoroughly discuss and share with our preachers who will tell us whether it is wrong or whether it is right. Otherwise, blindly following party is not right. And today, we need Delhi government. But if it is against our tradition, our customary law, it is against the ethic of humanity or our society, we have to speak out. For me, and I feel for regional parties, or for believers, it is not acceptable. I as a Naga, I can compromise, I cannot compromise the, my identity as a Naga, my culture, tradition, my laws. And also, I cannot compromise my religion. This is the stand of the regional party.